Hello everyone, welcome back to Firefighting Simulator The Squad. Today we're going to be getting in and continuing right where we left off in episode number three. Now, normally we start these episodes, or at least at some point during the episode, we come down here to the training facility and do some sort of the, you know, one of the prompts or whatever. However, we've gone through all of them, so we really don't have anything to go down there for. Now, we might visit this later in the future or whatnot, but for today's episode, we're not going to be going to the training facility. Instead, we're going to be jumping right into it. We got two fires that we have to tackle. The first one, smoke on the bungalow. Uh, looks like it's probably an outdoor, I'm guessing like a shed, or excuse me, a bungalow or like a, a deck fire. And then we also got one called ladder and elevation that we'll get into. It looks like the whole roof's on fire. So we'll get into this second. We've had smoke on the bungalow the longest, that mission the longest. So we're going to start with that. And I want to say I want to go for the Viper because I just, I just like, I like ladder trucks, you know, I like aerials. So I think we're going to go for the Viper today and start off with that. Hope everyone's having a great, uh, Wednesday and, uh, it's just enjoying the week. I know, uh, oh, that is so loud. Let me, let me turn that down. I got to turn that down. There we go. All right, let's turn the lights off. Hope everyone's enjoying the week, having a great week so far. Already halfway through. Okay, we're on. We're on the way. I I always hit the wrong button. I'm used to GTA. Oh, now we're going to have a slow driving time. Come on, dude. This truck is so slow. I'm so used to GTA. The, in GTA, the, the pushing down the left stick changes the camera. Whereas this game, pushing down the right stick changes the camera. And left stick resets you. So, I'm still not used to that. It's alright. We're going to have to... We'll have to catch up to the engine. Won't be too bad. I'm a little more reckless than they are, so. Driving time's gonna be slow though, probably, which is not great. Oh, we're catching them a little. We're going opposite lanes. People don't get out of the way in this game. I've noticed that they, they don't pull over a whole lot. They just kind of park in the center, which is normal for like, you know, any sort of game, really. Like GTA, they do the exact same thing when you're spawning emergent. We're catching the, uh, we're catching the engine. We're almost to them. Okay, fire's spreading, and they're not sure about evacuation. That's not ideal. So, primary search is going to be the first goal, as well as getting a hand line established. Probably split up into uh, two teams here. What the uh, engineer and the Charlie firefighter. Establish a water supply pole line, and myself and the Delta firefighter will probably do a primary. Depending on what the conditions are when we arrive. Wow, this engine is reckless. And we're with them. I don't see... We're arriving on scene, but I don't see any smoke. Okay, I see it. Okay, park, get out. Oh, yeah. Okay, we need power cut. Okay, power is going to be number one. He's going to be doing a 360 on us. See what we got. Okay, it's not actually an exterior fire, it's all interior. We got window bars on the front windows and rear windows. 
Okay. All right, let's. Okay. You. You got a line pulled. You got a water supply. Okay. All right. Uh, you. I want you to follow and get a pry bar. We're going to have him breach this door. I'm with you, boss. Lead the way. Yes, sir. Uh, you. I'm with you, boss. Lead the way. I'm with you, boss. Lead the way. He's going to breach it. I told you to breach it. Oh, it's, oh, we got a victim right here. Uh, one. Yep, you hit fire on that, or hit water on that. Come on, dude. Get this lady. Please. Oh, what do we got? Three. Go there. Who are you? One. Take that. Okay. You keep doing that. I'm going to do a uh, rest of the primary here. See if I can't find a power. Oh, we got another victim. I'll take this guy. Okay. All right. We got two victims. Still, I'm still trying to li figure out and learn the, uh, um, the, uh, like, AI commands to, to get my teammates to do things. I'm still kind of, it's, it's very weird when you have three or four. They only teach you with one, but when you have three, it's a little bit different. Okay. Lady, really? You're just going to walk down the sidewalk? Uh, you? Uh... Okay. They gotta push back a little. We still got lights? No, we don't. Okay. Yeah, I know. I'm doing- we're doing a primary right now there, bud. Okay, I still- I still hear... Oh, oh boy. Uh, three, two. I don't see, I don't see any other victims right here. So we're going to do one. We're going to get him to a, grab a supply line, grab a hose. I'm going to do a 720, which is just an additional 360 here. He's going to establish another hose line. I'm going to see if I can't find... Here we go. The power. Okay, electricity secured. We got water on the fire. I'm going to vent a little here. There we go. Okay. Alright, one. I want you to... You're going to come in and assist them. You go assist them. I'm going to grab a fourth line and probably hit some exterior attack here. Um, we're going to drop that bad boy. Don't need that. Uh, what do we got? What do we got? What do we got? Uh, I'm going to need an attack hose. There we go. Uh, attack line. Remove that cap. We're going to connect it. Uh, 
drop that real quick. We'll grab a nozzle and hook her up. We got water. Okay, let's do this. We're going in. Actually, I'm going to hit it from this window, I think, right here. See if I can't do a little exterior attack here. We do got some pretty good smoke production coming out the windows. Let's go interior with them. It is rolling pretty good out those windows. Don't forget we got victims in there. There's still victims in here? I mean, we couldn't get to them, so... We did an entire primary. I don't see any more victims. Oh, here we go. Get that guy out. We missed the room. I mean, the fire didn't spread, so that's good. But man, we missed we missed the entire room. And granted, this entire thing was uh, like fully involved. I didn't even see that door there. All right, that should be uh, that should be it for this fire, man. We got we had four hose lines in operation, three victims saved. Really good, really good smoke production coming out of that uh, A B side there. Oh, fast mission time just expired too. No. Okay, objective complete. Debriefing in three seconds. Yeah, we had real good smoke production coming out of there, which is not ideal, actually, on the Charlie side as well. The fire was pretty much contained to that uh, that hallway and those alpha side rooms, that office and that, uh, um, I guess it was, an it was one room. It was an office-bedroom combination. All right, medium driving time, medium mission time. Challenge bonus is 750. We got uh, behind the fast food unlocked. And we're about halfway through our level, so rooms vented too. We had uh, five doors open, three victims rescued. We opened a bunch of windows, broke a couple windows as well. Get some of that smoke vented, so that's good to hear. Ooh, so that's the next one. We might have time to do that in this episode. We'll see. But this is the next mission, ladder and elevation. I wonder if we're going to get the T-Rex unlocked here because they got a T-Rex parked out front. So they're talking about ladders. So we're gonna use the Viper again because it's a uh, min mount ladder. It's an aerial device, so we got the ability to flow water off of it too. Uh, there's a, it's a technically a quint that's got a pump on it, so we can pull four four hand lines off of it. So Yeah, it did. All right, we're 2,900 meters out. We got a T-Rex in front of us today. So two aerials go into this. This would be, uh, if we need any aerial support, master streams, anything like that, we got it. Oh, no, I hit the wrong button again. Damn it. Must have Opticoms on these because all the lights are green. Oh, I got it. Did I hit them? Whoops. It's too busy with my horn. Yeah, these guys just don't move at all. That was confusing. It told us to go straight there. And then they turn, so I turn. What the? I guess we'll just follow these guys. I mean, why not? Okay, evacuation status is unknown still. 
Apparently there's no closer units because we're literally the other side of the, I'm assuming, county. With the amount of, like, suburbs and whatnot there is to downtown. About a thousand meters out. Victoria Springs. Okay. So still no update. Still possibly got party strat. I'm going to try to pass this T-Rex. Not going to happen. Totally just passed that dude. Oh, that would never happen in real life. Okay, we got police on scene. Okay, we got fire from the roof. Uh, probably gonna need to get the aerial up for this one. We'll get, uh, two guys with hose lines. Ooh, look at that palm tree. Cinematic. Already looks like we got aerial, or ladders. Entire building appears to be laddered, so... Okay. That's good. Alright. So. Alright, supply line's ready to go. You. No, oh, come back. You get a hose line. Um give me this. I'm on. I'm on. Supply line is ready to go, boss. I've got your back, boss. Okay, we're gonna force this door here, do a quick primary because evacuation status is unknown. First floor appears to be good. Yes, All right, you take that one. I'll take this one. Got two victims coming out. Yes, Put that guy there. You can start hitting that with, uh, that firefighter. Looks like that's a nice stadium right there. I wish, I wish I could run with this guy. Come on. Transport him already. Come on. Come on. I'm trying to get fast time here. There we go. Alright. You're with me. Let's go. Finish our primary. Okay, yep, they're still going. Clear. Bathroom's clear. Kitchen. I think this goes to where we just were. Yep. Yeah, okay. Uh, is this an exterior? I think this is exterior, but we're going to breach it anyways. There we go. Okay, we got a victim at the end of the hallway. Get that guy, my partner, to come and uh, grab him. 
Front door's been unlocked. Okay, we got we got backdraft here. Hold on. Let me, uh... Let me take that nozzle from you. You, uh... Get another one. I'm gonna breach this. Ho oh ho! Yep. Knew that was gonna happen. Alright, let's take care of our, uh... Our escape path here. In case shit goes sideways, you know. Okay. Make an attack on this room now. Pushing. Cover this side of the door here. Wow, it's it's cooking in there. Oh boy. Wow. It is toasty. Um, two. I want you to get a hose line too. I don't. I told you to already get one. Oh yeah, it's toasty. It's a big room. Oh my god, it goes all the way back here too. All right, we got another. We got two more hose lines in route. I don't like this back here. This is not, not making me feel safe whatsoever. Nor is this roof. Okay, we got... Uh, one, two, three. We got four hose lines in operation up here. That is so hot. I can feel that through my computer screen. It's that hot. Oh my god. Looks like it caught the bed there. Let's see if I can't get some attack on this corner here. Not really. We're gonna have to just work it around. Did we get the roof behind us? Okay, we did. Get the, the, the dresser. Get the wardrobe. It's on fire. Yeah, it, it caught the bed. The bed might be our ignition point, to be honest. Everything was contained to this room and the roof, which was right above this, this side anyways, so. Okay, it's raging. On that roof, I think. We're gonna go through the window. Yeah. Um. Let's get the aerial up. I'm just gonna drop this here. We're gonna get the aerial. 
We're gonna hit it from the roof. Um, we'll use ours. I was debating on whether to use theirs or not, but we'll use ours. Oh, no, we gotta put outriggers. Now we can, now we can use the ladder. Okay. Boom. Extend this guy out as far as it'll go. Um Okay. Switch the nozzle control. And we're we're cooking now. Now we're making an attack on it. Slowly but surely. going to be able to hit the back side of that from ours so we might have to use the t-rex over there we'll see maybe possibly yeah we're gonna have to I think we're going to have to use the T-Rex here. Nope, I want outriggers. Okay, well, that's doing that. Uh, We got to find the power. I totally forgot about the power, too. I like this guy just... That, that female over there, that neighbor just standing there chilling not a care in the world where is the power is it interior i think it's interior not in there where oh where is the panel there it is Disconnect. Beautiful. Okay. So, outrigger should be extended. They got a water supply established, it looks like. Actually, I was going to enter command C, but we'll go right in the bucket. Screw it. Oh, they already got it. Nice. Just about the time I was going to do the bucket. All right, then. Look at that. They got the fire out for us. That's awesome. They were able to hit it from the ground while we were lollygagging. I mean, we hit part of it from the, uh, the uh, Viper, but... That's good. Let's see what we got. It wasn't fast mission time, but driving time medium, mission time medium, unlocked achievement lieutenant, which is nice. Challenge bonus 750, and then oh, what a shed. Not too bad. Opened 12 doors, rescued three victims, vented some rooms. Overall, not a bad day. So we got, uh, we should have two unlocked here. Yeah, oh, what a shed, and behind the fast food. Now, I think we got time for one more in this episode, and I think Behind the Fast Food is going to be the best. Now, we're going to use the, uh, we were going to use the pumper anyways. It is the only one that'll let us, it'll let us use for this one, but we're going to use the TP3. I think that'll be nice. It looks like a, uh, either a trash fire, like a dumpster fire, or 
something like that. Looks like we're the only unit responding too, so it can't be too bad. As if a choking person wasn't an emergency. Okay, no information on this yet, whether it's a car, a dumpster, or something. The actual restaurant. Whatever it was. The only thing we know is we were coming from a choking call, and apparently that's not enough an emergency for him. I didn't even hit him! Oh, we got a turn. Turning. <laughs> oh, if your engineer's not a little reckless, are you even on a fire truck? Okay, we're about 4,000 meters out, so we got a little bit of a haul here. I'm going to go opposite lanes. Luckily, there's not a lot of traffic, to be honest with you, on this road. As I say that, we get into some traffic, but not bad. About 3,000 meters out now. This, Like I said, this is a little bit of a haul here. But not too, not too, too bad. We'll see, uh, see what we got. Getting there, about halfway there already. Now I know I'm going to probably get comments... Oh, you got to clear intersections, whatever. Yeah, I mean, if this was GTA, and uh, I actually have a uh, SAFR fire video coming out here shortly in our DPS showcase, but if this was SAFR or you know, multiplayer or whatever, we'd probably clear it, but in this case, I just want to get there. I have never achieved fast driving time. I want it. So I don't care how reckless I am. It's okay. It's a game. Get over it. Now, 1,700 meters out now, give or take. I have no idea. I've never been on this part of the map. So this ought to be interesting. No smoke present yet. I don't have a smoke column. Which we haven't had one for the last few uh, fires. I would have thought, especially the last one there, the entire roof was on fire. I would have thought we had a smoke column. Looks like we gotta take a right up here at this intersection. And we should be pretty close. Should just be uh, right over here on the other side of this like warehouse looking thing. Oh, there we go. Oh, we got a fire. What do we got? We got a car fire. Copy that. I'll do a 360 check. It looks like we got a fully involved car fire. Maybe some fluid on the ground that spread to the pavement, but we'll see. Let's get on it. Okay. I found a survivor. All right, we have a victim. Yeah, that's at least one, maybe two cars involved over there. Maybe and I that might just be a dumpster fire. Okay, I'm I'm good with the cinematics. I want I want to attack this. Okay, we're gonna go in. I'm gonna take uh uh you you get us get a hose. You you're gonna grab a pry and follow me. Okay. We're going to go get this victim out. Dad, what is... 
Got cash over here. Okay, we got a car fire. It is just a fully involved car fire. That's not too bad. So that guy's going to get the victim. We're going to grab a third uh, attack line here. Connect our line. Go out back. Equip a nozzle. Kill, couple it. We got water. He's got the victim. Um, you. Hose line. So we got on all clear. Might as well just grab hose lines. Uh, three. You're going to go there. I'm going to come over here. And we're just going to make some attack on this. Oh, we need foam. Okay. You scratch this. You're grabbing an extinguisher with me. We got oil burning. Now yeah, open it. Open it. Open it. All right, let's go. Oh, fast time expired. No. Oh, yeah, we're making progress now with this extinguisher. Uh, two, you're going to go over there. Hit it from that side. Whoa! Oh ho! Little flare up there. Bud, you wanna you wanna hit the fire maybe? No, apparently this guy doesn't want to hit the fire. You. You're you're creating issues. I'm trying here and you're creating issues. Yeah, yeah, there's the oil. Uh okay, I'm gonna swap. Cause you don't wanna do anything. Average time expired. No, that's not good. My guys aren't doing anything. They're just standing around. What, do I have to do everything around here? There we go. Yeah, tons of oil over here. Look at that puddle. I don't know. Yeah, I guess that's oil. Wasn't sure if that was oil or what. Not too bad. Although, uh, apparently, when you give your firefighters an extinguisher, they do absolutely nothing. Driving time fast! I guess that makes up for the slow mission time. I mean, hey, it's better than nothing, but we got a fast driving time! Woohoo! Rescued one victim, nice. Nice, nice, nice. Well, we got uh, one more for the next episode, and then I think we're going to unlock some more after that, but... We, got a, we still got a ton to unlock. But thank you for tuning into this episode of Firefighting Simulator The Squad. We got uh, three fires done. We got Smoke on the Bungalow. We just did uh, Behind the Fast Food, which was actually quite fun. And then Ladder and Elevation. So I'm super excited. We're uh, almost ready to level up. And uh, yeah, so we, uh, yeah, we'll see you next episode. And uh, continue. I mean, we still got tons of fires to do. And and whatnot so i'm super excited i'm loving this game you guys are obviously loving this as well so i'm super excited but with that being said thank you for tuning into this episode and we'll see you on the next one peace